<laughs> well, hello and welcome again. Welcome to my YouTube channel and my name is Karen Abney and this is Randy Whitaker and he works for Castle and Cook and we just wanted to talk to you really about looking, um, trying to get you guys to look at things in a better perspective. Um, so, you know, usually if we talk about something in a year, it doesn't really click. So let's, I'm going to have Randy talk about, you know, you not buying a house in three years, in just three years. So, and what does that look like, basically? Well, if you think about it, hey, I'm going to sit on the sidelines for a few years, two, three years, and I don't want to buy a house right. because I'm worried the market's going to crash. Yep. Well, let's say your rent's $2,500 a month, $2,500. Yep. You're going to look at over 25000 in rent every year. You take it for three years. That's $75,000 that you've given away. You've just given to an investor. Given it away. Basically, you've, you've bought down their house payment and you've given the investor a tax write-off. For those three years, you didn't get anything. You didn't get anything. You didn't get the tax write-off. Yeah, you didn't build the equity. No equity, you no write-off, yeah. and you paid somebody's rent. Right. So the longer you wait, the more you're losing out. You've got to get in there, you've got to get a house. The sooner the better. If it's easier to get now, right. that is easier and better for you because the market's turned a little bit in your favor. You might get closing costs paid for versus paying Absolutely. 10, 15, 20 grand above market value like it was a few years ago. Listen, even a year ago, people you know, were coming to us and they're like, we gotta buy a home, we gotta go home. I'm like, okay, you understand that you may have to pay anywhere from thirty to $50,000 and you gotta pull it out of your account just to get you into a home. Wave people, appraisals. Wave appraisals. No home warranty, no home warranty as, as, is, as is. And people are like, yeah, 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 yeah. Whatever you know, it takes. We don't want you like that. What we want to do, because it is a buyer's market now, is we go to the seller. We ask for closing costs. We ask, or we ask the money to buy down the interest rate. We are in charge, right? We're in control, which is what we want, which is so much more beneficial because you're going to be able to keep a lot more money, at least thirty or forty thousand dollars in your account, okay? Unless you are so scared of the interest rate and you so you want to put more money down and you want to have a better interest rate even though you can change well, you it can, in two years you can change it you can get the seller to help con contribute to that right the thing about anytime there's a huge inflation run which a lot of people are worried about right there's always a dip in the rates afterwards yep. so love your home like your rate we're going to eventually get you a better rate but you're not going to be able to get a home if the rates go crazy low again we experienced that two years ago how yeah. hard was it to get somebody a home a first time home buyer could you get a home no so it was really hard i mean i probably wrote 15 to 20 contracts to, to get somebody and, and again you know your first time you don't have a lot of money so putting somebody in a home that was as is no home warranty, no home warranty. you know i i, I just make sure the roof the air conditioning because you know they will have to or they it possible that they're going to have to take out a loan just to redo the roof mm -hmm. or the air conditioner. That's anywhere from fifteen to twenty thousand dollars. So listen, it is the time to buy because why? We can't change the rent. We can't change these investors. Keep continually raising your rent. So you you know you need to be in a in a situation where it's a benefit to you and you have some kind of control over your life. Well, the right? thing that that people are banking on is oh, there's going to be another crash. The loans nowadays are mostly 30 year fixes. There's no people that are gonna be dropping their houses and the market's gonna crash 200,000, you're gonna be able to get home so cheap. Right. The market's stable, the rates are, they're not risky loans like they were before, so. Big time. These homes are gonna be, there is a home shortage. There's right. gonna be harder well, to is. get homes. Mm -hmm. So if you think rents are gonna drop and you think prices are gonna drop, I'm not sure that's gonna happen. Highly unlikely, okay. So anyway, we just, we're just we going to keep talking about real estate, and thanks for joining in, and we'll talk to you guys later. Bye.